technology and the marketing mix crazy igcse welcome back to crazy igcse hi this is crazy igcse where you can study seven igcse subjects at one place the subjects include business economics accounts biology physics maths esl solved past papers paper structures and tips so here is igcse at your fingertips please do subscribe and like and here is the syllabus content. We'll define and explain the concept of e-commerce, the opportunities and threats of e-commerce to business and consumers, and the use of internet and social networks for promotion. Advantages of advertising in networking sites. So first we'll see what e-commerce is. E-commerce is when there's selling and uh, selling and buying of goods or services through online means. Like now you have, uh, for example, Noon. So you order, you order your products which you want from noon and they deliver it to you while you're sitting right at home. You do not have to go to the store and buy it. That is e-commerce. And now the opportunity for the business is it is cheaper. They may not have to uh, rent a store for it. They will have less um, costs of running the business in like, you know, like they'll not have much of costs of renting the place that will reduce their costs and then to the advantage for consumers is that they can just sit at home and they can just it's very convenient for them to order their uh, goods which they want but this advantage is however is that there will be many exchange exchange complaints so if the consumer does not like the product then they will be exchanging policies where the business will have increased costs because the transport because of transportation costs then the disadvantage for consumers will be that they cannot see or touch the product and if they cannot touch the product which means they may be uh, not willing to buy it because they may not be sure about how the quality it is how the quality is or if the product is damaged so they can be uh, products which are sold and they may be damaged and some places may not have any return policy so that may also uh, discourage people from ordering online. Now the advantages of advertising in networking sites. So they can target specific types of consumers. The advertisement and information can be edited or updated quickly. It is quite cheap to advertise through networking sites. The disadvantages, however, are customers may find online ads annoying and the pop-up advertisements will cost money for the business and the advertisements can be edited by audience in a bad way which will create a bad reputation and reduce customer loyalty advantages of advertising in the own website so the business will not have to pay for ads if the website is already hosted the ads can be changed or updated anytime they can provide more information on their own website because it's they will exactly know what to promote their business for this advantage is, is that there will be few viewers because people may not know about the website and that's why it may not be seen by people so there will be less consumer awareness this is the end of the topic i hope you found this useful thank you for watching crazy at gcse and do subscribe and